One of the most important periods of time and happiest period of time was my childhood. Um, and I can say that I had a very colorful, beautiful childhood. This is all because of my family who did really everything to make it um, so. Because we had also in our family a um, big tragedy. It was a death of my father uh, when he was 26 years old. Even though it happened, um, my family were trying to do everything as they could and I had really everything. I was going on swimming, dancing, singing and also on a piano. I had the best toys um, and they were really trying to make my life uh, colorful. When I was a little kid, like 13, 14 years old, I was playing my first piece of Franz Liszt and I remember I went on a lesson to my professor and in the end of the piece there was a lot of jumps and uh, he said to me, Tam Tam, fortunately you cannot play this piece because you are uh, too young for that and maybe you will come with this piece in two, three years and I went out from the lesson, I was crying, first crying a lot and then I just took the scarf <laughs> and I practiced three hours, only the jumps uh, and on the next lesson I went and he was <laughs> really shocked and I, on this, after this day I felt that I, I can have a goal and I can really go for it and um, I think it's uh, very important when you are a pianist. One of the most important person in my life is my grandmother who is also a musician. She was the one um, whose idea was of course that um, I started to play a piano and she was always, always by my side and she was the first person who believed that I can really become something. Till now, um, she's calling me every day <laughs> and asking uh, how everything is going and how much I am playing and she's the best critic for me. If she doesn't like anything, <laughs> then I am uh, the most sad person at this time. But if she likes it, I'm the happiest. <laughs> Sometimes I'm, I am a very cheerful person, but sometimes I have my sad moments. It's like really switching very fast. <laughs> I have also a little sister uh, who is always uh, with me. She's, a, she's like a big sister of mine <laughs> because she's always taking uh, care of me. I can say that I'm a friendly person. I like to have a contact with people. Our problem is that we are whole day alone. Musicians are whole day alone with their thoughts, uh, with their ideas. And in the end of the day, I really need <laughs> other people to have contact, to share my emotions. And about emotions, I'm a very emotional person, which is also advantage and disadvantage of mine because I can be nervous about every small thing but it also helps me um, to play and I think it is very important when you are sharing your emotions through the music too so I think it's more advantage than disadvantage uh, I also want to mention my mother who is not a musician at all <laughs> And in the beginning, she couldn't understand why I was doing that. <laughs> now she's very proud of me and I'm very happy. For me, it's uh, very important to have a contact with public when I'm uh, performing. I won't always want to stay as an honest musician uh, and put the whole heart and soul in every note. This is somehow very magical moment you can feel the public how they react on your music or how good they are listening to you so i think it's um, just amazing <laughs> <laughs>